The Great Ape Alone versus King Kong is a great matchup. I'm leaning heavily towards King Kong, and I would think that he would win. And if you haven't watched King Kong, spoilers ahead. Now, before you call me biased or anything, uh, hear me out. We haven't seen any great apes since the Saiyan arc. During the Saiyan arc, Vegeta was able to blow up planets pretty easily. He could take two fingers and zap a beam in the middle of the earth and blow up its core. Now the great apes range between 30 to 50 feet because the anime and manga, they're a little bit different. Now here's why I think King Kong might have an, a, a chance. Wouldn't be a total blowout, but he has a chance. Originally, King Kong was around 25 feet tall. By the time we get to King Kong versus Godzilla, he is 393 feet tall. And that's according to Wired. So thank them for doing calculations for me. At this point in time, King Kong also has his magical axe. Any of the other giant cryptic and mythical creatures cannot take King Godzilla's blast. And if they can, they have equally destructive capabilities. What I'm not saying is that King Kong would survive a direct Godzilla blast, but King Kong's axe could, and it has, and it absorbed it. He could very well take on Vegito.